After a busy few days of sailing, island hopping from Miljet to Split, stopping at various islands along the way, including the Paklani Islands where we left you guys. We've been busy getting the boat in tip-top shape for our besties to arrive from Australia. And now, finally, it's the day of their arrival. Okay, so today's friends are coming and they'll be here in T minus 30 minutes. Um, I don't know how they're gonna go on the boat. I think Miranda's gonna be okay, but I'm not sure about Crystal. It could be the other way around. <laughs> you, you know when you, you know when you um, say, oh, we're staying on a boat, it's gonna be so cool, but they don't realize like sailing, the are small, a sailing boat's so different to a power boat. So we'll soon find out. It's gonna be good anyway. It's good. It'll be funny to watch, that's for sure. They have also come at the worst time possible. I'll get my phone and show you guys what's going on with the wind at the moment. So this is the wind situation at the moment. We're here. Um, this is like, reds pretty much don't stay away from it. Don't go out in it. And tomorrow we're supposed to be leaving to go to Viz, which is here. And this is how it kicks up tomorrow. It is nuts. Like that's 33 knots out there. The wind, the wind's actually changed a bit. So yeah, very unenjoyable. But we'll give it a whirl if worse comes to worse. And we feel on, it's going to be downwind, so it should be a little bit more comfortable. As long as we keep it on a 120, um, we should be okay. But if everyone's not comfortable doing it, we'll turn back around, which will be fun if we get halfway there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> or we'll go to another island somewhere and... Organise a ferry for, for them, three of yeah. them to get to Viz. We're just like, I'm a little bit stressed because I'm, I'm worried that like, they won't be able to get on a ferry that last minute. That's what I'm worried about. Um, and we, I guess, hope that they can at least just get to their accommodation because it's not free cancellation or anything like that, so. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my God. Hey. Hello, how are you? I'm good, I'm good. <laughs> oh my God. What's going on? Oh Hello. Oh <laughs> Are you, you girls ready for boat life? Yeah. Absolutely. Are you? Yeah. <laughs> Straight into boat life. Oh, so how is how's the journey here? I think oh, I feel like you stitched me up. She said I was sitting in the dryer spot. Oh my <laughs> god, Miranda's <laughs> fully like you jumped in a bath. Look at my bum. Mate. How are you, hun? You're pretty dry? Yours. Yeah, you're not bad? I'm pretty Go dry too. So. I was stitched up. You can't up. even tell. Hang on, I'll give you a towel. It's good. <laughs> we had the interesting task of showing the girls how to use the manual yeah. toilet. And then back that way. You just have to take, so it'll be locked, so you can't pull it. Mm -hmm. So you just gotta unlock it. Okay. Pump it five to ten times, switch it, pump it five to ten times, switch it back, lock it off. Okay. What do you, you do? You got that crystal? Yeah. I remember. Okay. <laughs> if there's Get away. <laughs> <laughs> but it's sort of a bit of talk trying to hear. Me. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a long time, guys. <laughs> and then the rest of our friends arrived on Escapade. Say hello, everyone. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Crystal. Hey. <laughs> Mitch. Hello. Sorry, you've got to say hey. Kira. Hi. Donnie, hey. aka Anthony. Hey, Miranda. Jason. Oh, I'm, I'm still here. Um, right, what are you doing? I want to see right, you. They gave us a present. Uh, we don't know what it is. I'm nervous now. I want to thank you guys for having us on board and because you're going to be cooking. Oh, uh, my God. We've we got, have, can Jason wear a naked? It's got, got out the back, I know what it is. We've got the apron, so maybe you can well, imagine it. Well, the fuck's on it. What's on it? You gotta put it on and then turn around. Oh, that's normal. I thought I was gonna have a naked person on and I'm like, God, it does. <laughs> turn it around. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, Jesus. Go to your That's a big It kind of like fits your body. And then... <laughs> it kind of, it kind of looks like you. It's and this one is for Jason. Do you think Jason's oh! cooking? <laughs> That's so good, I love it. Yeah. Bloody eyes. That's we had a few windy weather cocktails and a fairly early night, ready for day one of sailing tomorrow. 
Good morning. <laughs> we had a bit of a rough sleep last night. Just blowing over bloody 30 knots for the girls first night. How was it? Ideal? <laughs> <laughs> it's good for me. No, I didn't oh no, nah, it wasn't good. So hopefully we're moving on today. We're gonna attempt to sail to Viz where the rest of our friends are staying. And um, hopefully we have a bit more protection tonight. What are your thoughts on that? That's good. <laughs> we're out of here. All right, we're leaving at the worst time possible. Yeah. We've got the Gold Coast Suns versus Richmond. Miranda goes, Miranda goes to Richmond. <laughs> Who are winning? <laughs> Just. <laughs> but we're leaving now. We're going to head to Viz. The weather's calmed down a bit. We've got all our friends on board. And Janae's going to be pulling up the anchor. I need my phone, so one sec, hon. Hold on, guys, we're having some technical issues here. Jason's forgotten his phone. Are you the filmer today? I don't know, he just gave it to me, so. G'day. I'm making already. <laughs> bye bye, split. We showed our new crew the basics of sailing under just the head sail. We were sailing downwind, so we decided not to set up the main sail. In the end, we actually had a great sail from Split to Viz. Luckily, the wind direction was as forecast and we had a nice downwind sail. We tried to take it as easy as possible not to freak everyone out on their first sailing day. If the wind felt too strong, we pulled the head sail in and motored so everyone felt comfortable. Although Mitch and Jason loved the feeling of the boat healing, Kira did not. Of course, all great sailing adventures are made better with a beverage in hand. Although, I'm not sure I'm too confident in Dadi's pouring skills. We arrived in Viz and decided to check out a beach called Stonchika Bay, just east of Viz town where we would stay for the next two nights. Attempting to pick up a mooring ball with five other guests on board was interesting. <laughs> Yes. Ah, reverse. Oh. <laughs> oh. After getting that first windy sail out of the way, I felt like we could finally relax and enjoy being with our friends. Mm -hmm. 
Everyone was pretty wrecked from a big day of sun and sailing, so we enjoyed a chill dinner out and had an early night. The next morning we picked up our crew and made our way from Viz Town to one of the island's most popular beaches. We've just arrived at Steneva Beach. Is that what on it's Biz. called? Steneva. Steneva. Steneva Beach. Let's have lunch. Hi the water. Girls in the paddleboard. <laughs> the water's so <laughs> Can you come feed me some grapes today? You wish, I actually have grapes too. <laughs> <laughs> we spent the day relaxing, swimming, snorkeling, eating and drinking. There was plenty of other sailors around ready to party, so we headed over to our neighbour's boat for some drinks. Ahoy! Crystal, what are the odds? What are the odds on that drink? You've only got a little bit left. And then you have to say it, and then when we go three, two, one, you got to yell the number between like that number. Come on. I don't like games. I don't like games. I don't like fun. Playing games. I'm anyway. Just gold. Daddy. Zero, I'm going. Daddy. What are the odds? Uh, three. Three? Okay. Three, two, one. Two. Back on me. I don't even get it. Ready? Three, two, one. One. I'll grab it. I got in. I feel like I've got in really good here. Go. It's reverse. Back on him. One. <laughs> There's no reverse. Oh really? <laughs> Just push. No, there is, but it's complicated. Bro, just do a circle. I thought you were driving this. You started it. Why are we all driving? I did, didn't I? <laughs> <laughs> that was actually really good. Kids can start the tenor better than you. I know. She's stronger than me. She's a little pocket rocket. Good morning. morning. We're all a little bit hungover. So we're gonna jump in the water. Might make us feel better. I'm not jumping. <laughs> <laughs> We picked up the crew and made our way to the Paklani Islands, where we'd have a pretty chill day before our music festival for Crystal's birthday the following day. All right, so Daddy's going to attempt to jump over our stern line. Come on, Daddy. Come on, Daddy. Come on, Daddy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow, this brilliant idea of Daddy's turned into a full blown competition. Yeah, humour will get some bonus. Oh, yeah, I like well. that. Oh, it's going to be hilarious. I bet we better get the music going. Um, so, yeah. All right, let's do it.
Okay, so firstly, going from I'll lead up to it. Oh. The loser oh, okay. is Mitch. Oh. 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 I think, yeah. I think you know what it is, the you judging got easier. You know what we're fighting, though. Everyone knows what's ahead of you. Yeah. And then we've got Kiz. What? Yeah, it's okay yeah. <laughs> and then we've got Daddy. It wasn't just about that, that funny shit. Blah, blah, blah. And then Daddy. Although yours is really funny. And then Jen. And then Jason. Okay, you guys have to Of course, then the boys decided to do a trick round, which the girls decided to stay well clear of. The next day, it was Crystal's 31st birthday and the day of the Ultra Beach Music Festival. We explored Havar Town and had a birthday breakfast for Crystal before a big day ahead. Happy birthday! Cheers! surprise everyone with bottle service so we lived it up in our own private booth for the day it's some feel like why can i get over over you your love is a fire still i am the fumes i've done everything i know i can do i still I don't think we filmed anything else the next few days after that. We were far too hungover, as you can probably tell. We hope you enjoyed. It was a bit different than usual, but of course, we wanted to bring you along on our crazy week with friends. <laughs>